Recording in progress. Hey, Malik, what's the, the level of frustration uh, for you guys, whether individually for you uh, or the team, after having one like that get away? Uh, can you repeat that? Yeah, sorry. Just wondering what the level of frustration after letting that uh, get away and how it did and, and what you guys think you can take from it moving forward. Oh, yeah, man. Um, coming out in the, in the, in the third quarter, um, that, that it got away from us right there in that little stretch, man. And uh, shit's super frustrating, man. Uh, we've been doing this all year, man, and we know we know what it takes. That's that's why it's so frustrating for us. Um, but yeah, man, we just got to be locked in um, as a whole together, and um, I think we'll be all right. Malik, what's it been like for you that this on this back to back in that starting spot and playing off LeBron, uh, playing off Russ? What's been the focus for you individually? Yeah, man, um, just trying to get to the lane um, and space the floor and knock shots down, man, to to to, to open up the, the the court for those guys. Because um, when they open court, man, it's, it's kind of hard to stop both of them, man. So I've just been trying to mix up what I was doing um, to to balance the floor and um, keep it open for them. Malik, are you starting to feel like one of the guys um, – most responsible for for the team's success or lack thereof, becoming one of the the consistent guys that the team relies on on, on a nightly basis. Yeah, man, I, I try to take that role every. It, it don't matter if I'm playing a lot or not, man. I try to take that role and 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 everything that comes with it, man. I, I want I want to be that guy. Um, so yes, sir. I've been, I've been coming in the games thinking thinking that and playing like that too as well. So yes, sir. Yeah, sorry. Um, just on job, 41 points from him. There was one point where he scored 16 in a row for the Grizzlies. What kind of broke loose for him, especially in that second or third quarter stretch when he started getting hot? Yeah, man, we started fouling, man, and he went to the free throw line um, and, and started seeing the ball go in, and he got his rhythm that way. And when the guys get to going like that, man, it's it's not that much you can do. Um and yeah, man, we just got to stop fouling. Yeah. Malik, um, obviously turnovers can, especially live ball turnovers, can be triggers for the other team, gets them out into transition, easy baskets. But I'm curious, psychologically for you guys, being a high turnover team, um, how tough is it? Uh, I see you shake your head there. I mean, it just seems like every game there's four or five plays. You just kind of wonder, how did that just happen? Yeah, like I said, man, um, just being together and, know, and and trusting the other guy um, and not trying to do everything by yourself. Um, we still a – I don't like saying this shit, man, but we, we still a new team, um, still still figuring each other out. Um, but, yeah, man, we just got to – we got to trust the next guy. Yeah. 